this is the hot sauce, all right? If you're still talking about Sriracha in 2019, get fucked. Outcome Athletics. I was just thinking in the car. Sometimes it's good to be self-aware of like what you're good at, what you're bad at. We can go into another video of what I'm bad at. I have a long laundry list of things. Um, but kind of building a community, building a team. Uh, and I think because of my cool mentors, um, my first strength coach, Dean Durham, my high school basketball coach, Dean Stark, uh, my father, um, among other things, being a captain of the basketball team for three years, uh, things like that. I think I have some leadership in me, I'm running a couple companies, et cetera, et cetera. It's just things that I'm good at because um, I've had a lot of practice with it. coaching, training. That's a form of leadership, uh, whether you're doing classes, teams, online, etc. Uh, and so it's cool to kind of see the evolution even over, what, four weeks training with Ben. Day one, it's me, Ben, and Connor. Uh, day 10, it's me, Ben, Connor, and Alan. Uh, day 20, it's me, Ben, Connor, Alan, our buddy Jason. Uh, and day 25, it's me, Ben, Alan. Uh, Connor, Jason, our boy Ryan who's in town, and the one and only Filipino Thunder. So uh, today we really got after it. I was going to go for a PR. Um, I did go for a PR on the squat. I hit 518, which is 235 kilos, uh, and it felt really, really good. Didn't feel heavy on my back, and I, I didn't, I lost some speed, but I didn't like grind it. So that's pretty, uh, feels pretty good going into vacation. I'm going to try to get two days of training, but um, leaving on that note is really good. Supposed to clean 135, and uh, I whiffed it. Elbow's a little weird. <laughs> Wrist is a little weird from the cleans on Monday, and I think mentally I just got ahead of myself. And honestly, I'm enjoying weightlifting because I'm a beginner um, and because I'm a little nervous, a little scared getting into the weights. Uh, and I feel a little defeated, uh, to be honest. Like, I've lifted heavy weights in powerlifting, not the best in the world, not even close. I've played high level basketball against some really good players, and uh, I don't care the same about powerlifting. I don't care the same about weightlifting, but there's something about weightlifting that feels a little competitive to me because I want to prove that I can lift mediocre weight at least, average weight, something to raise an eyebrow at. I want to prove that to the world because everyone's known me as, you know, the slow, fat power lifter. People don't know me as the basketball player, the athlete that I used to be. And although I'm past my athletic prime, arguably, um, I know that I can clean something that's pretty, I don't know what the word is. Respectful. Respectful. At least something to like put it out there, you know, and, and make kind of a statement like, dang, Mike probably was an athlete. Um, so. It feels a little defeated to miss 135. I'm, I'm down, but not out. Shout out to my Call of Duty fam, everybody on Twitch. So, uh, not not exactly what I wanted. I missed it twice. First time I missed it just because I think I was overthinking the pain of my wrist and the, the, the weight on the bar. And then second time, I just overthought everything. Uh, shoot, shot my shoot, shooted my shot too early. But uh, it is what it is. Fun training with the guys. Hopefully we can get them together more often. Um, and hopefully we keep building a community, not only here online with all you guys, uh, but the guys I train with uh, week in and week out. So it's a lot of fun. I'm heading on vacation. We gotta take Ryan to the airport. I gotta pack up. I gotta shower up. I'm an absolute mess. Video's coming every Monday. Thursday, Saturday. Check out 50% Facts on iTunes, Spotify, everywhere you wanna learn about more fitness, life, and health. And uh, I'll be back on Twitch in about two weeks. So follow me there, Silent Mike. We have a lot of fun building the community there. I appreciate you guys. We'll catch you in the next time. I'm out of here. I'm gonna work up to my opening front squat. I'm competing this weekend in a front squat contest. Uh, I'll hit my opener with uh, knee wraps, or I'm sorry, knee sleeves and belt. Everybody else will be doing a heavy back squat up to a single, and then we'll be working heavy cleans off the blocks. I'll be doing some snatches, probably some like lighter power snatches off the blocks.
Or take like a 5.15 for like a mini. Okay. I only know kilos, I don't know pounds. So I think I did 220? <laughs> All right. Who's my heaviest? Or no, I'll do the math. Nice, dude. Yeah. Getting in so I don't crush my hand. Yeah. So just put the collars on 230. Make 235. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm gonna need some kid rock radio. Come on. Let's go. Maybe Beach Boys. Easy, come on. Yeah, you just hit it a little bit. Here. Oh! That was scary. It is, dude. Think about when I do it by myself. I'm like, God, I hope I don't cut my finger off. This is the hot sauce, all right? If you're still talking about Sriracha in 2019, get fucked, okay? This is the, this is the sauce, all right? Second of all, Limp Bizkit. Yeah, yeah, this will get you going, you know? 250 back squat from Marcus. He is the, well, he's the only bigger Filipino than I am. I have not seen one bigger than me, except for him. One day I'll fight him. It's called hip spin. It's called hip spin. Come on, let's go. Oh no! You got that? Come on.
down here. <laughs> Are you going? What is that? 125? Okay. I used up all my mana on that uh, <laughs> double attempt.